Hi guys, welcome to the sixth video of the 30 day one funnel away challenge and I'm in my quick funnels and membership site right now. I want to show you exactly how I got to this uh, page. One of the challenges that we had to complete was to actually pay for our ClickFunnels subscription and have our account up and running. Okay. So I've gone into ClickFunnels and I've paid for my account. So that money doesn't come out now for 30 days from now. So that will be the 17th of February for me. All right. And before then, I will have a funnel up and running as a result of being in this 30-day one funnel away challenge. I'm excited. And you get to watch the process. So let me just go to this here. Okay. So this keyboard's too huge. Whoops. Okay. All right. So, um, I want to go here. Okay. There we go. Now, so this is how you log on. You go to Click Funnels, and you log in and it's going to take me straight to this page there is a page before this page that shows you the different packages and you simply all you need to do is you've if you've already had a click funnels account like I have and you simply need to update your payment information so that you can continue using click funnels okay um, you simply need to click on upgrade and it's as simple as that and they put you on the $97 a month package okay which is nothing okay so in comparison to all the value you're going to get out of using click funnels i'm just checking out what they've put here in the notifications okay i've seen all them And they've put new stuff in the help section I can see. There's a new community that you can join, join the conversation. That's new. Let's check that out. Feature requests. have a look these must be I'm um, guessing that these are suggestions that people are making to add to click funnels so that's a new feature there I've never seen that before but yeah the purpose of coming into my click funnels account was to just to update press update and that means I'm now they're just going to bill me in February for 30 days my accounts up and running again okay so that's it that was one of the challenges let's go to the sheet so as you can see uh, checklist for today watch Russell's video and then his 10x event presentation uh, fill out the worksheet below as you're watching sign up for click funnels either for the free trial or check out the special offer at the end of the 10x secrets presentation okay go to the one funnel away community and comment on today's mission thread when you're done with the word mission complete I'll be doing that after I take a screenshot of this video and when I've uploaded it to YouTube I'll screenshot it and um, upload hashtag mission complete to show them that I've finished the uh, mission Right, so what is the one thing, story, idea that Russell said during his presentation that really stuck with me? Announcing the full price of the product at the start of his presentation, the 10X presentation video that I just watched, that really stood out to me. Why? 
because um, up until that presentation, I, I haven't seen people um, in their presentations or webinars, whatever, uh, announce what the price of their product is at the start of the presentation. I thought that was a really cool strategy. Okay, announcing the full price of product at the start of the presentation. Okay, so I put here, yeah, why do you think it gave you a reaction? What about it relates back to your own life, business, fears, dreams, hopes, etc.? And as I just said, it is a surprising strategy, uh, is, is a surprising strategy, but it makes sense. Okay, it makes sense to me um, because it pre-frames the people that oh, it's going to be this amount at the beginning and that's the full price and then he, re and then he reveals the discounted special offer price at the end and people are like, oh, whoa, you know, I was like prepared for it to be like $11,995 and then if they're getting it at, at a much, much, much lower price at the end, like they were prepared, they were like, okay, this is what it costs. Okay, so they're preparing in their brain that that's what they're going to have to pay at the end, okay, if they want to buy that product. Uh, but um, And at the end, when they see it's a lower discounted price, um, they're definitely in because they're like, okay, well, it, it could have been this price, but it's actually this price, which is a lot better. I'm definitely in, okay. So, yeah, it makes perfect sense. So maybe that's a strategy I can use in my webinar when I release my funnel. Okay. Um, what else did I put? I put modeling. Okay. Uh, Tony Robbins preaches this to model what works. Uh, if you want to have a successful funnel, uh, successful Facebook ad, successful webinar, um, successful YouTube video even, a successful info product, a successful um, anything. Tony Robbins, I've read about it in Tony Robbins' book, which is what Russell Brunson spoke about in his um, presentation when talking about how to get traffic. You simply model what works, what the, what the successful people are already doing. Just copy them, okay? Not... Um, not exact word for word stuff sort of thing, but similar, okay? You model what works and you and, for, and that goes for anything. Uh, sports people do it. They want to be a good sports person. What do they do? They go study someone that's a successful sports person, right, and do exactly what they've done. Singers do it. Um, I don't really, I'm not a fan of Delta Goodrum, but I, I think her strategy is that she's modelling like Beyonce, what she does with her perfume and uh, with her, the way, like her performances and stuff like that. Not that she can dance, but I mean, I can I can see her sort of modeling Beyonce. Okay, so I think that's what's going. She's doing everything Beyonce's doing. I'll put it that way. Like being in TV, uh, doing everything according to what Beyonce's already been and done. Okay, to get the same level of success. All right, so Tony Robbins preaches it. Model what works. Anything you want to achieve in this life, you simply go seek out the people that are already achieving that and you copy exactly what they're doing, okay, to get the same success. It makes perfect sense. All right, um, selling the who, this is a great one. Who, what, how, why script, okay? That's the selling script. Russell Brunson uh, demonstrated that in all different scenarios. He pulls out his phone. Um, he talks about who. Who is it? What? What is it? How? How can you, how can you get the product and why? Why should you get this product, right? So the how is click on the link below. Why should you do that? Dot blah 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 sold that's how you sell do it on video um with everything you are talking about trying to sell um even in these youtube videos i'm going to start modeling that more prepare more because i just you probably um realize that i just talk off the cuff um ad lib that's how i operate 
but I'm going to start using the who, what, how, why script with every video that I do, okay, to keep things simple and clear, okay. And with every video, even when you're not when you're not selling a specific product, you are selling. You're selling them the person watching on why they should be watching you and why should they continue to watch you. So I'm going to start implementing that now in everything I do, the who, what, how, why script, all right? Um, and why do I think this gave me a re this reaction? What about it relates back to my own life, business, fears, dreams, hopes, etc. Because the sales script is simple and powerful. Okay, simple. I like that. I like things I can just implement simply. I'm, I hate complicated stuff, right? And it's powerful. It achieves what I want it to achieve. Okay, and it's something I can remember. Right, it's such a simple idea. It's simple to implement and it's simple to remember. Who, what, why, how, who, what, how, why script. All right, and that's something that I learned about. Um, I did a journalism course, okay, and that's something that I learned about when creating um, any sort of article. You're always, especially a newspaper, in the first headline, you're writing who, what, how, why script. And when, they put when, there's always a date there in the first line, okay? Who, what, how, why, when. But you don't need it when you're selling, basically. Telling a story or just or selling, you don't need when. Unless you, and this, there's a time limit on what you're talking about. You must um, click on the link below before this certain date because it will no longer be available, this deal, Okay. In those sort of situations, you would add the when. All right. So pick a way to tangibly capture this lesson so you don't forget it. Uh, I've clicked journal it because I'm creating a YouTube video about it right now that you are, you're watching right here and now. So that's done. Snap a photo of this and post it in the group to be held accountable and hashtag mission complete. So that's all I have to do now. Um, so I'm going to upload this video, snap a photo of it, and hashtag it in the group. So this is done. I hope you join me in the next uh, One Funnel Away Challenge because as you can see, these challenges at the moment, they're quite easy and they're going to have major impact, simple and powerful, as I just said, the sales script is. Same can be said about these challenges. Simple and powerful, major impact and easy. I love it. So I'll see you in the next video. I'm Miranda Wright. Thank you for joining me.